So she looked at the lady of the house and she said, my husband is a drunkard like everybody in India also talks to my husband. Even that time, 13th century also, husband is a drunkard. <laughs> I don't know why, why man is always a drunkard. I don't know. That is a different story. Drunkard, he never comes home. Whenever he comes home, he'll fight with me. He'll borrow money from outside, again keeps drinking. My house is in pathetic situation. So, Guru, the teacher said, don't worry, I'll give you some money, buy a little wine and some good food. So, the lady of the house buys and she goes to sleep. And when he waited, the husband arrives fully drunk and said, my good wife, give me some good food. And Guru, the teacher gets up and said, I, I was traveling. Your wife gave me a place to stay over here. So I've prepared beautiful wine and good food. Please have it. So the husband eats it and he goes to sleep. And he's sleeping. Guru was sitting in meditation, taking care of the husband. When the husband woke up in the morning, he was shocked to see the master sitting next to him meditating and he asked, who are you? And the master said, I am the teacher of the emperor. Teacher of the emperor in my house. He was shocked. And the story says, he got up, he apologized and the master was about to leave. He said, I will please allow me to leave you a little farther away, a little far, farther away for 10 minutes or 10 kilometers. He walked and the master said, you go back. He said, no, another 20 kilometers, another 30 kilometers. They went further and further. At last, the drunkard man refused to go back. Refused to go back. He refused to go back to his drinking habits. He was so apologetic. The master can change. He found a diamond in the muddy road. When you are in the street, yes, you are thinking that is street culture. No, no. You can still find a diamond. Mahatma Gandhi said, Hatta guna guru. Ten gunas in a man, nine is bad. Umpat tappu. One day one the chana girute. One is very good. Talk about the one. And you can change him. The 13th century, Zen masters are talking, find a diamond in the muddy road. Even you can find a diamond in the muddy road. There is a man in Indranagar, his name is Swami Rakumji. Every time when people come there, people will tell, uh, he used to tell people, please come and visit my school. Please come and visit my school. Why I should visit your school? When people ask, he used to tell, when you visit my school, I find... God in you, please visit. And whenever you are coming, please bring something. I don't have anything in my house to bring. Then Swami Rakamji used to tell, whenever you are sweeping the house, there will be dust, you know. If you don't have anything, please bring the dust and give to us. What do you get in the dust? So Swami Rakamji, I find gold, I will find small, small gold pieces in the, in the dust. And the people said, in my house you don't find any gold pieces. You can't find any... Uh, gold pieces in the dust. Swami Rakamji said, when you come to give the dust, I'll make you smile. In the smile, I find the gold. And you made my children also happy. My children feel happy that more people walked over here. For you, you also got an opportunity. You see, there is a variety where you have to share it. You are constipated. You got indigestion, you have excess money, but you're not willing to share it. The more you give, the more it comes back. I gave you a chance. You came and saw the school. You are telling stupid Rakum, stupid Swami Rakumji. He's a robber. He's using the children's name and making money. You will tell and you go and tell 10 more people. And those 10 people think maybe he's not a robber or they wanted to see the big robber. They come to Rakum school and they see the small children. <gasps> First time they sing blind children. First time they're chilling. Every children very happy, jumping, dancing, non-stop active. To one side there was a dance going on, one side there's music going on. <laughs> one side the drama going on, one time the cooking going on, the cleaning going on. Non-stop active, flowing water, fresh water. In that flowing water of the happiness, of the richness, there is a diamond they find, they find peace. 
Shanti, Om Shanti, Shanti. In that they find Purna Mada, Purna Mida, Purna. They find the Purna. Oh my God. No medicines could cure the diseases. But most of the people who walked into our school, they find all the diseases vanish. Some people totally disease vanish, which doctors couldn't cure. Just watching the non-stop flow. That is what Guru has done it. He was non-stop flowing, moving into the street. You also should move into the street. You should move into the different, different for yoga, karate, music, dance. When you reach home as a husband, as a wife, you must make sure you come back from your place. You must do your electrical plumbing, sanitary, masonry, painting, etc. That is very, very important. And when you do all those in the road, you find diamond because you become so conscious that you have to make sure that the solar lights, when sunlight, whether you have collected enough solar lights, the panels are clean, you have electricity free, that saved money. It's your fixed deposit, you have power, you roll like a thousand men over. I the Kodi Kandadigar Shakti. Five members become I the Kodi Kandadigar Shakti. Five members become five million power in, in your group. Each group is a five member team. Feel, smell, taste, touch, and say, Artha claim. When you do that, you will not become a slave to the day scholars. You convert the day scholars. When I was having my school in Indranagar, it was dirty, muddy. Everybody used to walk in. If you ask them to leave the slippers outside, go, whoa. Even in the prayer time, they walk with the slippers. And one day I, I got some money. I put nice, uh, what do you call it? Uh, flooring, tiles, uh, granite stones inside the hall. And everybody was leaving the slippers outside. I went, so even if I tell them, you can wear your slippers and shoes inside, they tell, no, 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 it'll dirty. Say, that floor made them to become disciplined. If you practice, they become disciplined. And teachers come to your classrooms. When you open up the next subject with the teachers coming, read louder, uh, reminding everybody this is social science teacher is going to come. So and so the chapter louder. Others might laugh first, but later on they will follow you because they are concentrated. They find a diamond in the muddy road. Like the husband, when he reaches home, he finds a diamond in the muddy road. The moment he reaches home, he removes it, just folds it up and rushes up to see where the electricity is. Plumbing, sanitary, masonry, children are in proper position, wife are in proper kitchen is running well. Then he can relax and sit so that he can sing together, family with sister together, used to praise together. In that family, sister together, used to praise together. You find a diamond in the muddy root. <laughs>